Diego Pacheco versus Genk Plana. Plana. I, am I saying his name right? I apologize for mispronouncing his name. But yeah, uh, who do y'all think is going to win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So uh, this fight between Diego Pacheco and uh, Plana uh, will be taking place this uh, coming weekend on the 5th of March, March 5, 2022, live over at the Pachanga Arena in San Diego, California, USA. In the undercard of the Roman Chocolatito Gonzalez versus Julio Cesar Martinez fight. Event will be shown live on The Zone around the world, so tune into The Zone if you want to see this fight. And uh, yeah, before I talk about who I think will win between uh, Diego Pacheco and Glenk Plania, to those who don't know who Diego Pacheco is, he's a 20-year-old fighter from Los Angeles, California, USA. Currently undefeated, 13-0, 10 wins coming by way of knockout TKO. Young fighter, learning and improving fight after fight. And at the age of 20, he's done a pretty good job so far since he turned pro in 2018. I think he was still in high school, I believe, when he turned pro. Crazy. <laughs> 20 years old, so he's going to be around for a very, very long time, so start paying attention now. He's going in there against Glenk Plana, a 28-year-old fighter from Hagerstown, Maryland. Man, that's not too far where I live. Um, originally from uh, Kosovo, and uh, he is currently 9-3, one draw, five wins coming by way of knockout or TKO. He's coming off a knockout win against Brandon Robinson. Before that, he had two losses in a row to Maydel Sando and Rafael Igo. Buckway. and uh, you know here he is traveling to um, San Diego to fight Pacheco does Glenk Plana have what it takes to beat the uh, young up and coming prospect Pacheco in my opinion no after watching some footage of Glenk Plana um, yeah he, he, he seems a little sloppy with his punches um, doesn't really have that much pop Pacheco like I said earlier, has been improving fight after fight. He's looking sharper. Fight after fight defense is looking better. Um, you know, the boxing IQ is just improving. And I think Pacheco should be able to go out there and outclass Plana. I think uh, there, there, he'll show um, why there's levels in the sport of boxing. And uh, Pacheco is, will show that he's a completely completely different level compared to uh, Glenk, Genk Plana. Um, again, I apologize for mispronouncing his name. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm butchering it. Um, and yeah, and after watching of watching fo footage of Plana, he, t he tends to have his hands down, and you know, like I said, he he's very sloppy with his punches. So I, I won't be surprised if Pacheco ends up stopping him, knocking him out. I'll say round number four, round number four. I'll be shocked and very surprised if Pacheco somehow loses this fight. You never know; anything is possible in the sport of boxing. I've been wrong many times before. Uh, look, just honestly, looking forward to a great weekend of boxing. And um, and yeah, like I said, I'm I'm picking Pacheco to win by fourth round TKO. I could be wrong. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.